Good morning, amazing human beings. I am so excited to be here with you. We are continuing our Kindness Week events. So today's going to be a really special story. It's called The Spot of Kindness, and it talks about how really it's important to be kind. We learned yesterday that when you perform an act of kindness, right, that it allows you to move forward in a way that makes you happy. And then you in turn bring joy to someone else, right? So it's really like a domino effect. So today we're going to read our book. I cannot wait to get to it. So I'm going to share my screen and we'll talk a little bit more afterwards. This book is read with permission from Diane Albert. A Little Spot of Kindness, written and illustrated by Diane Albert. My name is Spot, and I'm not just any ordinary Spot. I'm a little Spot of Kindness. I've never seen a Spot of Kindness before. What is a Spot of Kindness? A Spot of Kindness has a sticky back. The reason my back is sticky is so I can help kindness stick to you. Whoa. I come in so many colors. Because the easier I can be spotted, the easier it will be to remind you to be kind. Did you know that every time you are kind, a layer of happiness is added to your heart and to the hearts of others? And since you both have the power to make good choices, you can start making the choice to be kind. I know sometimes it's hard to remember to be kind, and that's why I'm here to help. All you need to do is place a spot on your hand, just like that. Now, every time you spot me, do something kind. I can't draw, this looks horrible. Don't you know that all great art starts with a scribble? I see it's working already. Great job using encouraging words when someone is feeling sad. Remember, being supportive is being kind. Can I please play with your dinosaur? Sure you can. Thank you for asking. That's wonderful that you're sharing toys. Remember, sharing is being kind. Saying hello to someone who is alone is a great way to be kind. Remember, being friendly is being kind. I am so lonely. Hello, would you like to play? Saying please when you want something is one of the easiest ways to be kind. Remember, being polite is being kind. May I have some more water, please? Sometimes being kind can be hard, like when you break something by accident. But this is a perfect time to be kind. Remember, apologizing is being kind. My favorite pink crayon. I am so sorry I broke your crayon. It was an accident. Do you need help? Yes, please. Thank goodness there was someone there to lend a helping hand. Remember, helping is being kind. It's always fun to make messes, but it can be hard to clean them up. Remember, cleaning up after yourself is being kind. Waiting in line can be difficult, but not getting upset is a great way to be kind. Remember, being patient is being kind. Now grab a little spot of kindness so you too can remember to be kind. Hope you liked our video. Please subscribe. And I love the idea of really intentionally being purposeful and being kind, right? So today I'm going to be giving your teachers um these stickers right here so there'll be like spots of kindness so you could actually put them on and remember that when you look at that spot it should be a reminder that you should be extra kind and you all know how to be kind i've seen so many people be kind i've seen people include people and in, during recess or sit with someone that may be sitting alone during lunchtime or 
congratulating someone and telling someone that they look beautiful or that they're really cool. So there's so many different ways we can be kind. A nice smile is kindness, right? So definitely practice that kindness and have an amazing day.